Hey y'all, it's Vic. Um, coming at you live from my bedroom. Uh, I know it's been like, I don't know, maybe a week or so, um, that I've made a video or whatever, but I've been like really, really, really busy and like I've really been getting a lack of sleep and at the same time oversleeping or something. I don't know. But, um, this is kind of a serious video. Um, it's just something that I need to get off my chest and, uh, talk about. So, um, I kind of wanted to talk about something that I've, I guess you could say my eyes have been open to this recently. Um, I kind of sort of have a shopping addiction. <laughs> it's really not funny because it's kind of serious now. And like, you know, back when I was younger or whatever, it was okay because, you know, I didn't really have any real responsibilities or uh things that I really, really wanted to save up for. I just kind of blew my money. But, uh, I'm realizing that I'm still doing that. And, uh, I've been trying to pretty much in my own way keep up with the Joneses, so to speak. Um, like, because I've I've just been shopping too much. I've been shopping too freaking much, and it's getting out of hand, and I'm starting to realize it. It's getting to the point where shopping doesn't even feel good anymore. It's just a habit. It's turned into a habit, and it's like, if I can't buy something, like, I kind of get it high off of buying something, and then when I get it, and I own it, it's like, oh... And then I get a little bit sad because I bought it. Because I probably didn't need it in the first place. Um, can any of you relate to that? Uh, I don't know. It, this is really kind of hard for me to talk about. Because shopping is what I love to do. Like, it's what I love to do. And I love everything about shopping. I like looking around and looking at new things, new trends. And finding things that other people can't find. I like uh, thrifting and going antiquing and all that stuff. And I'm just realizing that um, the more I shop, the more empty I feel inside. And, um, yeah, just a big old ball of emptiness. Like, I used to be able to go shopping and I felt satisfied, but now I don't even get that there's like no limit to my um shopping anymore like there's no button or I don't feel satisfied anymore when I shop I just feel like I need to find the next best thing um and it's really hard not to shop like today's my day off from work and I work really really hard and I work a lot, so when I get a day off, the first thing I want to go do is shop. <laughs> and, um, that's pretty bad. So, um, this, this, this isn't at all how I expected this video to turn out. It's, it, it, it sounds a little depressing, and I'm not trying to be all depressed or anything. I'm just trying to be real and real talk I have a shopping addiction and I um, I'm going to do something about it um, I think today is one of those days where I just took a look around in my room and looked at some of my stuff and really questioned 
why I bought certain things. Like, there are just certain things that I own that I don't need. And honestly, I hate to say this, but it has a lot to do with YouTube because I watch a lot of beauty gurus and stuff like that. I watch a lot of people, like makeup channels, I watch a lot of makeup channels, like to the point of where I'm almost addicted to that. <laughs> That's how much I watch. I don't even watch regular TV anymore. Like, I don't even know what current shows are on, except, I don't, I don't know, the last, it's been a while since I've watched regular TV. The last thing I watched, really watched on TV was like, Vampire Diaries or something like that. That was like oh nine or something. <laughs> so, um, yeah, but, um, and I know it's not, here's how I see it. Um, if you have the money to, to go out and buy expensive things, more power to you, but if you are like me and you are on a budget and you like finding cheap things for the same quality, then, you know, and it's like the more I watch these uh, YouTube gurus, the more stuff I want because they keep doing reviews and hauls and telling us what they bought that day and I swear some of the gurus they go shopping like every day but they have the means to go shopping every day and I guess somewhere in my mind I feel like I should be able to do that too because I've always kinda done it anyway um, and it, it started off with like stupid things like uh, It started back when I was probably a preteen or something. You know, I'd hit up the mall every weekend um, by myself because <laughs> um, I was a loner, still am, and I'd just buy stuff, you know, an outfit or whatever. And now it's gotten to the point where I want to buy everything and everybody else's everything. And, um,. I just don't feel right about shopping anymore. So, I kind of made this vow to myself that I wasn't going to buy anything else that I didn't need. <clears throat> like, unless it's an essential or something that's necessary, I'm not going to buy it. Um, I'm just not. Because it's getting to the point where I'm tired of shopping. I'm tired. Like I was in the, I was thrifting today, which was awesome. <laughs> um, and I'll show you some of the stuff that I got in another video. It's going to be a special video because that's probably going to be the last time I buy stuff for a while. But um, I was thrifting and I was looking around in the thrift store. There was a lot of awesome stuff and there was a lot of awful stuff. <laughs> And uh, I was just thinking to myself, like, I'm really tired of doing this. Like, why am I even here? I could be so many other places now. Like, I could be um, at the movies or enjoying, well, if I could find a freaking beach over here, I would be at the beach probably or on a picnic or even at the zoo if it weren't 120 degrees today. But um, I was just shopping and I was like I'm so tired of shopping and like I said as I was thinking that I was like grabbing something else and putting it in my basket I was like oh my gosh this sucks I'm shopping give me that give me that give me that <laughs> and uh yeah so it's become a really bad habit um and I, I I'm going to go cold turkey and stop and I think I don't want to put a specific date on it, but I'm probably not going to go shopping like that for makeup, clothes, or jewelry until my birthday. And to make it, to step it up a notch, I'm probably not even going to do that until something that's really important right now gets done. <laughs> and I'll let y'all know what that is a little bit later. 
but um, I don't know. So yeah, I have a slight, if not full-blown shopping addiction. Hi, I'm Victoria. <laughs> I have a shopping addiction. <laughs> Hi, Victoria. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, I just wanted to get that off my chest, because I needed to talk to you guys, because I missed you guys. I miss you. All three of you. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, it's about ten of y'all now. Um, so, yeah. Tell me what you think about this video. Tell me if you agree with me. Um, maybe you have a shopping addiction, too, and you don't know it. Maybe you are at the point where I am where I'm just like almost rock bottom to the point where it's not even funny anymore so let me know what you think you guys and yeah I totally just let you guys in to my emotional bubble here so welcome welcome to my bubble <laughs> alright y'all have a great day don't buy nothing but if you do buy something for me no I'm just kidding alright bye